the final, the big final of this year's PDC World Darts Championship will be between... Hi there, I hope you're all good. Thanks for tuning in to a brand new video here on the Dart Counter YouTube channel. So, it's time again. It's that time of the year. It's the most wonderful time of the year. No, but seriously guys, I have to light up my Christmas tree, just like every year. There it is. If you like this amazing Christmas tree, please leave a little thumbs up, of course. Now, on to the good part. And the good part, of course, is the 2022 PDC World Darts Championship. It's the 29th edition of this World Darts Championship, organized by the PDC. And it's about to be an amazing tournament. As we all know, the top 32 of the PDC Order of Merit is automatically qualified for the second round. The rest of the tournament is filled up with the top 32 of the Pro Tour Order of Merit and 32 qualifiers from all around the world. Now, as you might know, I'm gonna predict this World Art Championship today. And I say as you might know, because it's already the third time I'm doing this on this YouTube channel. In fact, exactly two years ago, this video was the very first video on this channel. The fastest game of the year, for sure. Michael Smith against Adrian Lewis. What an amazing game. Yeah, it was quite a while ago, and I can't say I'm the best predictor in the world. No, 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 not quite, no, no. The PDC World Darts Champion of 2020 will be Michael Van Gerwen. And this time, Peter gets it right. Okay. But hey, we're just gonna make some fun in the next couple of minutes, so if you're ready for it, let's do this. If you want to become better in darts, learn more about darts in general and get valuable tips and tricks, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss out on anything. Here we go. So, 96 players in Ali Pali. The complete draw can be found on either one of the social media channels, Dart Counter, Instagram, Twitter or Facebook. It's all over there. And now, I'm gonna start. So, of course, the number one seeded, the current world champion, Gurren Price. Look at this photo. Yeah, that's... come on. That's an amazing photo, right? Will he lift that trophy once again this year? We're gonna find out in a couple of minutes. So, Gurren Price will be facing, I think, Richie Edhouse. And I think he will win it, yes. Um, Kim Hybrex. Yeah, oh, yeah, against Steve Beaton or Fallon Sherrick. Come on. Oh, Fallon Sherrick. She's in such an amazing form. And, of course, it's, it's, it's never easy to play against a woman. Uh, for any man on stage with such a crowd um, But especially now when she's in an amazing form as she is right now for Steve Beaton and for Cam Hyrex It won't be easy. So uh, Yeah, I think Fallon will win against Steve Beaton and yeah, Cam Hyrex also has a good form right now But I think Fallon will beat him. Yeah, Stephen Bunting against Either Ross or Jeff Smith. I am not sure which one of those two players is better right now But I'm gonna go with Ross Smith uh, but I think Stephen Bunting will win it. Dirk van Duivenbode, a fellow Dutchman, will play against either Jermaine Watemina, also a fellow Dutchman, or Boris Kolsov. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Watemina. And yeah, Holland versus Holland. It breaks my heart. Of course, I'm, I'm from the Netherlands as well. And, and to see this kind of game so early in the World Darts Championship, it just breaks my heart. But I think, based on the last season, Dirk will win it. Yeah. Johnny Clayton, the man of 2021, let's be honest, he won multiple major tournaments, climbed up to the number 8 spot on the PDC Order of Merit, and of course he will play against Keen Barry, but he will smash him. Uh, I think Johnny Clayton will do very well on this World Championship. Gabriel Clemens against Louis Williams or Toyokazu Shibata, thank you. I think Louis Williams and Gabriel Clemens will win it. Michael Smith against Ron Muhlenkamp or Lisa Ashton. And yeah, Ron, Ron the Bomb Muhlenkamp has got a female opponent. And as I've said by Fallon Sherrick, that's not an easy one. No. But I've seen Lisa Ashton play on the World Darts Championships of last year. Yeah, and then I would say Ron Muhlenkamp would win it. But he isn't in a great form as well right now. So, uh, this is a tough one. I'm gonna go with... Then, okay, okay, I'm gonna go with Lisa Ashton against Michael Smith, but then Michael Smith, yeah, will win it. On to Glenn Durant. Yeah, there's one man who's in the worst form of his life right now. 
and that's Glenn Durant. Um, he will face Danny Lauby or William O'Connor. I'm gonna go with William O'Connor. Um, and then, yeah, I, I'm afraid to say it, but I think William O'Connor for the win as well. Yeah. Then on to James Wade, the current number four of the world. This guy is is so freakishly steady in the way he's playing darts. I mean, he doesn't win any major tournament normally, but. Yeah, the number four of the world, you can't underestimate him. Mike Ivanova or Kai Smith, I'm gonna go with Mike Ivanova and James Wade for the win. Vincent van der Voort, the number 29 of the world, fellow Dutchman as well. Adam Hunt or Boris Kretschmar, I'm not sure if you guys remember Boris Kretschmar earlier this year. Hitting like a 113 average or something, and it, 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 it's, it's like a beast, you know? I mean, the guy from Croatia, he's like the Hulk when he walks on stage. Uh, Boris Kretschmar, I think he will win it. But then Vincent van der Voort will be too strong, in my opinion, yeah. Joe Cullen against either Ted Evans, current world youth champion, or Jim Williams. Um, I'm gonna go with Ted Evans in a great form, of course. He won the world youth championship, you know, like last week during the players' championship finals. Uh, but Joe Cullen, yeah, he, he will win it, yeah, I think so. Simon Whitlock against Martin Kleermaker or John Michael. Mm, I, ah, this is a tough one. I'm gonna go with Martijn. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe it's because he's a fellow Dutchman, but yeah, you know, the first round, huh? Simon Whitlock or Martijn Kleermarker, Simon Whitlock. Dimitri Vandenberg against, yeah, this is, oh, this is a thrilling match. Florian Hempel and Martin Schindler, Germany versus Germany. I think a whole Germany will be in front of the TV to watch that match. Um, I'm not very familiar with the level of darts of Florian Hempel. Uh, I am with Martin Schindler, um, so I'm gonna go with Martin Schindler for this one. But yeah, Jimmy, the number five of the world, is doing very, very well this year, so he will be through to the third round, I think. Then Devin Peterson, the one with uh, the glasses on stage, <laughs> amazing man. Devin Peterson against Jamie Hughes, in my opinion, and Devin Peterson will win it. Christoph Ratajski. <laughs> Against Steve Lennon or Maris Rasma? Um, Maris Rasma is always playing very well on the Pro Tour, I know that. Um, but Steve Lennon is, of course, always a part of uh, Team Ireland during the World Cup. And an amazing talent. So I think Steve Lennon will win this one. But Ratajski, number 12 of the world, in my opinion, he will go through. Mervyn King against Ryan Joris or Roman Benecki. I think that will be Ryan Joyce, and I also think Ryan Joyce will beat Mervyn King. Yes, I think so. All right, on to the second half. Peter Wright. Peter Wright. You know, no introduction. Against Ryan Mikko or Fabian Schmutzler. I guess Fabian Schmutzler is a German fella as well. I'm gonna go with Ryan Mikko. Uh, but yeah, Peter Wright, come on. Damon Hita, uh, a new one in the top 32 of the PDC Order of Merit automatically qualified for the second round. He will face Luke Woodhouse or James Wilson, both very good dart players. Uh, I'm gonna go with Luke Woodhouse. And I'm also gonna give the win to Luke Woodhouse as he is always doing some crazy stuff at the World Darts Championship, so I'm gonna go for it. Then, the miracle of 2021. Let's be honest, Ryan Searle climbed from like the 40th spot on the PDC Order of Merit at the beginning of this year and is now sitting on spot number 15. I mean, what the hell happened there? Ryan Searle in the second round against William Borland or Bradley Brooks. Um, I'm gonna go for Bradley Brooks, as he is an amazing youngster, amazing talent. But yeah, against Ryan Searle, mm, I, uh, I think it will be a tough game, but yeah, you know, just with my eyes closed, Bradley Brooks. Yeah, Bradley Brooks will win it. Mark my words. Danny Noppert against Jason Heaver or Juan Rodriguez. Guess so. Um, I'm gonna go with Jason Heaver and Danny Noppert will win it. José de Souza, the Portuguese man, number seven of the world. Jason Lowe or Daniel Larson. I'm gonna go with Jason Lowe and José for the win. Mansur Stojovic against Alan Sutar or Diogo Portela. Diogo Portela always qualifies for the World Arts Championship, the guy from Brazil, but never really comes through the first or second round. Um, but I'm give, gonna give the win to him, yeah. Uh, but against Mansour, who also doesn't have his very best season, um, except for the World Cup with Robbie John, he did amazing there. 
Um, I'm gonna give to Wintermancer, yeah. Nathan Espinel against... Ah, oh, there he is. The legend. Yeah, start a clip, start a clip. Fire up the TARDIS. Take us back. Another there, for the most incredible nine dart leg of all time! Oh! 32. We would have witnessed the most remarkable thing I think any of us has ever seen in a darts match. Okay, he missed the double 12 there, but of course he hit him in 1990. Yeah, Paul Lim wins. But then he will have to face Nathan Espinel, and, and of course I would like to see Paul Lim go straight into the final. Yeah, because we all, we all love him, right? Come on. Um, but yeah, Nathan Espinel... Yeah. Paul Lim is like... Let me, let me look. He's 67 years old. 67 years old! And still on the World Darts Championship. It's, it's, it's amazing, yeah. Um, I'm gonna give the win to Nathan, but if it will be Paul Lim, I will be, of course, very happy because, yeah. Amazing guy. Brandon Dolan against Kellen Ritz or Yuki Yamada. I'm gonna go with Kellen Ritz and Brandon Dolan for the win. Yeah, he's doing very well again. Number 23 of the world. Amazing. Then, something I'm not very used to because Mike Van Gerwen is only down here in the bracket. Uh, normally he's always on top, always number one of the world, but this year the number three of the world after Peter Wright and Gerwin Price, of course. Um, he will face uh, John Norman Jr., I guess. And then uh, just will win it, yeah. Chris Doby against Rusty Jake Rodriguez. It's, uh, I guess, the brother of Robbie John, yeah. Um, or Ben Rob. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Rodriguez one, uh, but Chris Doby will win it, yeah. Dave Chisnell against Darius Lebanauskas or Charles Losper. And I'm doing this with Darius Lebanauskas because he always surprises uh, on, on the World Arts Championship. He's He's... Uh, not in the top 32 of the world, no, he, 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 I, I, I'm not sure if he will be one day, but yeah, he's always doing crazy things, so I'm gonna give the win to him uh, against Dave Chisnell, why not? You know, there have to be a few surprises in my bracket, right, because otherwise it would be so dull. Um, Luke Humphreys against Roby John or Nick Kenny, I'm gonna go with Nick Kenny for this one, but Luke Humphreys, yeah, the number 19 of the world currently, doing a very well job, he will win this one. Then the last four matches of the second round. Gary and... Yeah, come on. This match. Seriously. Who has done this draw? Yeah, I know. Colin Lloyd and Wayne Martel. But, but... I mean... Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Gary Anderson against Adrian Lewis. Both back-to-back -back world champions facing each other in the second round. What happened there? Yeah, I know what happened there. Adrian Lewis fell out of the top 32 and has got a very bad season. So I'm gonna give to win to Gary Anderson for this one, but it's... Pfft. Yeah, this will be one of the best matches in the second round, to be honest. Ian White against Scott Mitchell or Chris Landman. Yeah, Scott Mitchell for this one. And Ian White is, is one of those guys. He's always performing very well on the floor tournaments with no cameras at all. But on the big stage, not so much. Um, yeah, he fell down quite a bit last year to the 27th spot of the PPC Order of Merit. Um, but against Scott Mitchell, he will win it. And then... Another one of those matches. Rob Cross against Raymond van Barneveld. Yeah, of course, Raymond van Barneveld retired. We all know he came back, uh, climbed his way up the PDC Pro Tour Order of Merit, um, filled the third spot there, so he is qualified for the World Dolls Championship. He will beat Lawrence Illigan. Yes, I think so. But then in the second round, Rob Cross, which is... Yeah, you know, Rob Cross came out of nothing and became World Darts Champion as well out of nothing. Um, then he fell back a little bit. He's now number 11 of the world. But he's coming back. His form is coming back. We all feel it. We all know it. And I, I, I can't predict this one because Rob Cross, yeah, as I've said, a great form right now. But Raymond van Barneveld is Raymond van Barneveld. So... Uh, yeah, a very hard time predicting this one, but I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go with Raymond. You know, just just for the sake of it, um, he's the five times champion of the world, and I, I, I would love to see so much of him during this tournament. It would be amazing. Then the last second round match is Daryl Gurney against either Ricky Evans or Nitin Kumar. 
Ricky Evans, yeah, he will win that one, but Daryl Gurney will win that match, and then we're off to the third round, which starts with Gurian Price against Fallon Sherrock. Yeah, um, I'm sorry Fallon, but Gurian Price... I, 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 I can't let... of course I can let Fallon win, but I'm not gonna do that. No, Gurian Price will win this one, and for Stephen Bunting against Dirk van Dijvenbode, I'm gonna go with Dirk, yeah. Johnny Clayton against Gary O'Clemens. Ooh, um, yeah, Johnny Clayton. Yeah, of course, come on. The, 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 the best darts player of 2021, it's, it's, yeah, no doubt about that. Michael Smith will win against William O'Connor. Then James Wade against Vincent van der Voort. You know, Vincent van der Voort is also a player who never, you know, reaches, like, semi-finals and majors or something, but... Yeah, it, uh, yeah, I always have a nice time watching him on television, because he, he's throwing, you know, just really fast, and he's always... Yeah, quite positive, and yeah, the Dutch destroyer. Um, it, mm. James Wade, Vincent van der Voort, you know what? Just for the act of surprise, Vincent van der Voort, huh? Yeah. Joe Cullen against Simon Whitlock? Yeah, don't know this one. Just gonna go for Cullen. Yeah, why not? Dimitri Vandenberg and David Peterson. Really, this will be the, the, this match. Imagine the walk ons, you know? Dimitri Vandenberg with his dance, David Peterson with his uh, little mirror. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I'm already looking forward to this match. I hope it, 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 it will be, yeah, this match in the third round. Um, yeah, Dimi will win it. And Ryan Joyce will win against Christoph Ratajski. Yeah. Then Peter Wright against Luke Woodhouse. Uh, yeah, Peter Wright for the win. But Bradley Brooks against Danny Norbert. You know, Bradley Brooks is he's really a youngster. I'm gonna look up how old he is. Yeah, he's 21 years old, so I, I'm not sure how it will go with the pressure of the Ali Pali stage with Bradley Brooks, but he's such an amazing talent and he's throwing very, very well this year. And against Danny Norbert, who is also doing well, I think, I, I find this hard to predict. You know, I'm gonna just go with Bradley Brooks, just to see if he can handle the pressure of the Ali Pali stage. It would be Amazing, right? Jose de Souza against Mansur Sujovic. Yeah, I think it will be a very close match, but I'm gonna give the win to Mansur for this one. Yeah. Nathan Espinal against Brandon Dolan will be a win for Nathan Espinal. Michael van Gerwen will win against Chris Dobie. And Darius Lebanauskas against Luke Humphreys. Yeah, Luke Humphreys will win that one. Yeah, it's 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 not always party time for Darius Lebanauskas, to be honest. Last two matches, Gary Anderson against Ian White will be for Gary Anderson. And Raymond van Barneveld against Daryl Gurney. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so the, <laughs> the fourth round, Gurry Price against Dirk van Dijvenboot. Yeah, Gurry Price for the win. Yeah, come on, the number one of the world. He's in amazing form, you know, yeah. Johnny Clayton against Michael Smith. And this is the part where it becomes interesting because Vincent van der Voort against Joe Cullen. My god, one of these two guys will be in the semi- No, 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 quarterfinal. Okay, quarterfinal, yeah, but still. Yeah, I think Joe Cullen will win it, yeah. Dimitri Vandenberg against Ryan Joyce. Yeah, Dimi for the win, come on. Then, Peter Wright against- Oh yeah, Bradley Brooks, yeah, of course, no. Now, Peter Wright will win this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mansur Sujovic against Nathan Espinel. Um, yeah, a, a win for Espinel. Yeah, into the quarterfinals. All right, so the last two matches, Michael van Gerwen against Luke Humphreys. I think this also, yeah, you know, say I'm stupid, but I think this also will be a very close match, you guys. Yeah, but I'm gonna go with Michael for the win. And then the last one, Gary Anderson against Raymond van Marneville. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm from Holland, you know, so it will be great to see Michael van Gerwen against Raymond van Barneveld. We already saw this in the second round of the Players' Championship Finals. Um, but Gary Anderson, yeah, he's just performing quite okay this year. Uh, number six of the world. Yeah, Gary will win this one. Yeah. All right. The quarterfinals. Gurren Price against Johnny Clayton. And this is, oh, this is so hard. Of course, Johnny Clayton beat Gurren Price already this year. And, and, oh, Gurren Price, current world champion, but Joe Cullen against Dimitri Vandenberg. I'm gonna go with Dimi for this one. Yeah, semi-final spot for Dimi. Yeah, it would be great. Then, Peter Wright against Nathan Espinel. Yeah, Peter Wright for the win. Yeah, good year. Good year for Peter Wright. And he will face Michael van Gerwen in the semi-finals. Then, the first semi-final. I'm so curious how many of you guys would also predict this. Johnny Clayton 
against Dimitri Vandenberg. Um, and I'm gonna go with Johnny Clayton for the win. You know, he's had such an amazing year so far already, so I think he will keep his form into this World Arts Championship and beat Dimi in the semi-finals. But then it's Peter Wright against Michael van Gerwen. It's, 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 pfft, come on. How can you predict this? Um, I'm gonna go with Peter Wright. And just for the reason that Michael van Gerwen, yeah, of course, hasn't had the best year. And I think it's in his head. I think it will be a bit in his head that he has to win this World Arts Championship to climb in that PDC Order of Merit again. No, I think the pressure will be too high. So the, the final, the big final of this year's PDC World Darts Championship will be between Johnny Clayton and Peter Wright. Select tournament winner. Yeah. All right, all right, guys, what would you do? If you see this, select tournament winner, PDC World Darts Championship, Johnny Clayton or Peter Wright? Okay, I'm gonna go with Peter Wright. Yeah, prediction title. No, 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 Peter Wright, yeah, he will be the 2022 PDC World Arts Champion. Okay, um, prediction title, Dart Counter, con <laughs> Dart <laughs> no, Dart Counter Prediction, and it's submitted, it's done. This was my prediction for the 2022 PDC World Darts Championship. Please leave in the comment section below which player you think will be the 2022 PDC World Arts Champion. Uh, a link to this bracket, I will leave it in the description below so you can have a look at my bracket once again, but also fill in this bracket for yourself. Um, yeah, to see who gets the most points, of course. I sincerely hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, it would mean a lot to me if you leave a little thumbs up to it. Then I'm gonna turn off the lights of my Christmas tree again. I'm gonna say for now, have a nice day, enjoy this year's World Arts Championship. Oh, wait, one more thing. One more very important thing. I've got a big surprise coming up. It's all related to this World Arts Championship. Uh, it might have to do something with a giveaway. Please keep an eye on this YouTube channel within one, two, maybe three, no, I guess two weeks from now, there will be a video on this channel. You want to see that one. All right, yes, have a nice day, and I'm gonna see you next time. Cheers.